Our video for today is about MySQL Managing Roles. MySQL Roles Typically, you have multiple users with the same set of privileges. Previously, the only way to grant and revoke privileges to multiple users is to change the privileges of each user individually, which is actually time-consuming. To make it easier, MySQL provided a new object called role. A role is a named collection of privileges. Like user accounts, you can grant privileges to roles and revoke privileges from them. If you want to grant the same set of privileges to multiple users, you can follow these steps. First is you create a new role. Then second, grant privileges to the role. And then third, grant the role to the users. In case you want to change the privileges of the users, you need to change the privileges of the granted role only. The changes will take effect to all users to which the role was granted. So to create roles, we just type the command create role, then the role name. And we can create several role names. So up to several role names. So example, create role clerks, comma, supervisors, comma, managers. So I have here created three roles. Then, of course, the next is to grant privileges to these roles. So the syntax is grant privilege on then the object to role. So similar to granting privilege to users. So example, Grant select on Jack DBM to clerk. And then grant insert update delete on Jack DB.m to encoder. How do we assign roles to user accounts? So the syntax is to grant then the role name to and then user account. So for example, we create a user Daisy at localhost identified by Almonds and then grant encoder to daisy at localhost. So daisy now at localhost have the role of an encoder. Now how do we revoke privileges from roles? So we just type revoke privilege from role. Example, revoke delete from encoder. And to remove roles, we just type drop role and then the role, the role name. 